morning guys welcome welcome I'm getting tired so I thought I'm gonna start this a little bit early hey Jacqueline hi joy Carmen hello okay so those of you guys that watched me paint this canvas and it was pretty boring earlier um, it got really super good so after it dried I don't know if you can see how cool and marbly it is but I really really like it hi Carmen um, I really like it. Oh, what's that? That's part of my dinner that just fell off the canvas. Anyway, it came out really good, and then I did the moon while I was waiting for everybody, and I really like it also. So I do these canvases for a couple of the young girls that live, hey Jacqueline, in the area where I live, because they're all just having babies and babies and babies, and this is an affordable gift for them to give. I won't tell you what I charge because as soon as I'm done with this, the price is going up tenfold because, um, well, gosh darn it, I'm worth it. And I watched a Periscope video today with, um, with uh, Jenny Doe from Crescendo, and yeah, I learned that I'm really worth it. <laughs> um, but interestingly enough, she charges $30 for a lot of her canvases, and this is right in there in the $30 range. <laughs> So I do these for these girls because I know it's what they can afford and it keeps me going, keeps me on top of things. So me too. Oh, you watched Jenny Doe's video? Yeah, she was good. It was a good one. So we're going to start with Henry's name. So this is for a little boy named Henry. Oh, did you guys see? I used colored pencil, white colored pencil. Hi, Paula. How's hubby, Paula? Is he doing okay? Anyway, um, yeah, it was a really good one with her, really good. And she cusses, and that makes me happy, although until I get to know everybody a little better, I'm not cussing. I'm going to freaking try not to cuss, but I'm a cusser. Uh, anyway, so I did this in white colored pencil on top of the canvas, and then I'm just going to paint it in. So that's why you guys are here, and that's what I'm doing. I'm going to move my paint a little bit closer. And I'm just using acrylic paints. And when I'm done, um, I'm going to go trace around a lot of it. And I'm sorry if you guys are commenting and I can't see when I'm trying to draw straight letters. I'm going to trace around a lot of the lettering with um, colored pencil, which I haven't done before. And I think it's going to be super cool. Usually I trace around with um, this kind of stuff. These scribbles, um, puffy writers, which I still will. Oh my gosh, that purple is running like crazy. I have some really, really old paints, and I have some really brand new ones that I got at Target because my friend Joy told me that I should go get them, so I went and bought them all. Did you hear that, Joy? I bought them all. First I bought like six or eight, and then I had to buy the rest. So, anyway. This girl, these girls that, that commission me, I'll just say that. They do commission me to do these... Um, canvases and baby signs. First it was wedding signs and now they're done with weddings. They're all on to babies now. So uh, They commissioned me and they give me three colors. So this has purples, blues, and grays. And that's pretty much all I can use except for the rocket thrusters for the rockets. They're definitely going to be uh, oranges and reds. I mean, how can they not be? They're rocket launchers or, you know, thrusters. Whatever you call it. Paula, I wasn't looking. Did you say anything about your hubby? Is he out of surgery? Because this is making me calm down and not think about it. So I'm sure everything's okay. Hey, thanks. I think it's cute too. I usually don't like doing stuff for little boys, but uh, I kind of like rockets now. They're going to be fun to do. Hopefully you guys can see this. My favorite part is the moon move this a little bit so I can push this over. So far my favorite part's the moon. I don't know if you guys ever watched the bear in the big blue house with your kids, but um, my kids and I, well one of my kids, the other ones were too big, but we used to watch bear in the big blue house. Blue bear, Blair, bear in the big blue house, I think. Anyway, and he always sang goodnight to the moon, and the moon looked just like my moons. So that's when I started drawing them. When we watch that all the time, I love that moon. Hey, thanks for joining us, you guys. Thanks for joining me. I guess it's just me. 
I tried to get my hubby to come in and read the comments for me. Twinkle needs one with a robot on the spaceship? Okay. Oh, I would like to make one for Twinkle. Anyway, I tried to get my husband to come in and uh, read the comments for you guys, but he said nobody would like his voice. And I said, man, you sound like Sam Elliott. Uh, why would nobody like your voice? It's all deep and sexy. Nah. So I let him watch Chicago PD until I'm done, and then I'll go back in there and watch. I love Chicago PD. Hi, Linda. I think that's Linda. I don't know. I'm trying to remember everybody's email addresses. I'm no good. Bring him in. No. He's watching TV. He is not coming. I tried. Maybe sometime. Because I thought it'd be good. He could read the comments for me because I'm painting. I can't read them. I just hope I didn't miss one. Bring on Sam. Well, I didn't say he looks like Sam Elliott. I did, however, say he talks like him. I told him I married him because one day I figured his hair would turn into Sam Elliott hair. And then he cut it. So, well, go figure. Can you guys see that? Hopefully you can. I'm waiting to get to the rockets. I hope that since she said I could use gray that I'm allowed to use silver because I bought silver paint at Target and it looks like a lot of fun. So I'm hoping that that's allowed as part of my gray since they give me three whopping colors to use. These girls are so funny. They had like the perfect weddings and now they're having the perfect baby showers and the perfect baby rooms. It just makes me giggle because there are no perfect babies. For those of us that have had children, we all know that. It just makes me laugh. Okay, coming right along. Sorry I'm late. Oh, you don't have to be sorry. There's no right or wrong or late. I started early. So I'm sorry I started early, but I forgot it was my TV watching night. And I watched Chicago, well, last night. It's my big TV watching night. We do. I'm a TV-aholic. We watch um, NCIS. Chicago Med, Chicago Fire, I guess I'm into Chicago, and there's one more that I can't remember. Did I say NCIS? Yeah, one more, I can't remember. Anyway, and now tonight is Code Blue, which I love, and um, what's the other one? Chicago PD. So, I don't have to be there, it's okay. Yeah, Hub's they all love NCIS. I don't know what it is about that show, but my husband loves Ziva. She's gone, so now he just has me <laughs> and Abby. We'll be there for him. But I used to make fun of him for watching it. Now I watch it, too. It's good. Kind of good background while you're drawing. I'm waiting to hear from my friend Paula, who was here. And her husband is in surgery today, so we're hoping, hoping and praying that everything goes well. He's still in surgery as of like a half hour ago. It makes me nervous. It's getting late. Those doctors are getting hungry. Oops. Shaky hands. Do you letter or tinker while you watch TV? Well, I both. I don't know what tinker means, but I definitely letter. I usually am working in a journal, but right now I'm working on new products for planners. So if anybody has any ideas of what they want drawn for planners, let me know. We have a show coming up in July and everything has to be done by then. So I'm drawing my little hands off all kinds of um, new notepads, stickers, uh, washi tape, some other exciting things that I'm not going to tell you yet. Gotta leave something for excitement. All right, I think the name is done for the moment until we outline everything. So let's wash that brush. Can't wait. I love my planner too. I'm addicted to it. I'm going to a planner convention. I don't know where you guys live, but if you have a planner convention, I would go. I don't even know what you do there, except I know like in Girl Scouts, they have swaps. 
So I'm pretty excited about the swap. So we're all gonna get to swap stuff with each other. So that sounded cool. And I guess we just sit around and work on our planners? I don't really know. Surprises are fun, aren't they? I don't know if you guys can see way over here. I've got another rocket ship. I'm gonna go ahead and put the windows in first so they can dry. Oops, there was a big blob of water over there. Not good. That was from my brush. Hey, 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 Wimby Frog. I know who that is. That is Claudia. I got two frogs on here. I got Gypsy Froggy and Wimby Froggy. Those are my Golden Bear Girls. Hi, Claudia. How's the islands? The island. It's so windy here tonight, I thought maybe we wouldn't be able to periscope. That would be me, Claudia. <laughs> Two froggies. Those are my bitches. Well, there I did it. I just broke the cardinal rule and I cussed on Periscope. Whatever. Get over it. All right. So we'll let those dry. Another Claudia. Yes, I know three. All right, so let's try to get this one rocket ship right here done. Let's add purple up here. Probably should have done the silver first, but oh well, we'll let that dry and move on to another one. I don't get really specific with these because like with everything else I do, I go back and I outline a lot. That's my favorite part is outlining. And scribbling. I think I should have definitely done the silver first. Always start with lighter colors, Lindsay. That's what your drawing teacher used to tell you. Mrs. Barrett, she would not be happy with you right now. Work from light to dark. Whatever, it'll still work. I'm not used to painting. I don't paint a whole lot, so. I'm used to colored pencil. Yes, they're acrylics, whoever asked. Yes, acrylics, see? I use the very expensive ceram coat. And I have the newfangled uh, handmade modern from uh, Target. This one's avocado. Hey, Joanne. All right. Silver. Let's try silver. This looks so cool, this paint from Target. Oh my God, that's cool. It's definitely silver. They're going to dig that. Blow their little minds. I wish I could see some of these babies' rooms. Some of them have two, three, four signs for me in it, so they're going to really, hopefully they like their name because it's all over their bedrooms. That's pretty cool very silver. So if you bought any of the metallics of these Target pen, paints, Target, Target paint, I bought all the metallics. The copper, there's like a bronze. They're pretty metallic-y. I'm happy about that. Way better than gray, but I'll do a gray spaceship since they wanted gray. It's kind of thin, these metallics, but that's all right. You guys are still with me. I can't tell. I'm not watching anymore because it's hard to draw a spaceship and read at the same time. David Bowie could. Duh. Honk Harmon. David Bowie can do anything. But if you're not, you're not. It's fine. I gotta get this done one way or the other. He was singing. Who was singing? David Bowie? Jeez. I wish I could read. I gotta get me an iPad set up so I can read all the comments as I'm doing this. That's what 
what that other girl does. Can you put your Periscope videos on YouTube? I gotta figure out how to. I live in the middle of Nowheresville, and it takes, like, for me to do one video on my Vimeo, which is where my class is gonna be, my online class, took me 16 hours to download it or upload it. I don't know. I have the worst internet in the world out here in the middle of nowhere. But I will try. I will give it a shot. Who knows? I would be happy to if I could figure it out. Alright, let's get this rocket ship. Marianne Moss can't read while she periscopes either. Oh, praise the Lord. I want to be just like Marianne Moss. I really do. Not just saying that. Jenny Doe was jumping up and down today in her periscope video. Oh, it's so cute. She is so cute. She doesn't know who I am, though. Funny. Alright. Come to my place. I have fast internet. Okay, Joanne. Let me get in my car. I should be there in about nine hours. Alright? Or I'll just upload all my videos and come to your house for one day. But that's a nine hour drive. Really all I have to do is drive down the hill and I have faster internet, but kind of uh kinda of wanna do it here. That's my goal. So I'm going to my son's house tomorrow night and he is supposedly going to help me figure this whole Vimeo thing out. We're gonna get all my videos uploaded. And then Believe it or not, the pre-sale will start for the lettering class. All right, don't all scream at once. I know you're excited. Yeah, hoo! Yep, I'm not kidding. If he figures it out for me, and I'm not just a 58-year-old lady that can't do anything on the internet. Hey, I periscope. A couple of the young kids that I work with didn't even know what Periscope was, and that made me feel cool and hip. I'm like, you don't? It's the coolest thing. So anyway, back to that. Hopefully tomorrow we will get this lettering class thing beginning. I think I know how to do it. I just don't, I don't want to do it without him because I'm a little nervous. Thanks, guys. Look at all those pretty hearts. It's not even Valentine's. times. All right, I need a cool blue. How about Robin's egg? Isn't this such a pretty color? My friend Joy had all these and I was so jealous. Stripping on the side though. I vowed to keep these jars neat. Oh, that's pretty. I like them because they're very thick, except for the metallics. Metallics have not been so thick. But the rest of the colors are nice and thick and rich. It looks green. Well, it's here, say. Where's the color name? Well, it's Robin's egg. Here, it don't believe me. Robin's egg. It does look a little green. Do you think I'm going to be in trouble for... Well, I'll, I've got colored pencil going on top of it. I dropped my rag. So, um, if it looks a little too green, I can get rid of that because I don't want these girls to be mad at me. They are very modern and they follow Pinterest and they have to have it just like Pinterest. They actually send me pictures from Pinterest and then I go, mm, that's nice. I'll do what I want. <laughs> and I guess they still like it. So, oh, my purple wasn't quite dry. Rocket ship numero uno. Done. Let's do um, Saturn. I think. Let's see, doesn't that have to be a yellow color, Saturn? No. We're going to make it a bluey. White and blue kind of marbly looking thingy my bobber. Maybe some purple. This will be a weird planet. Those are some cool colors. Nope, more white. I 
I think I need a bigger brush. We need a bigger boat. Yeah, well. You think? Yeah, I needed a bigger brush. Well, <laughs> when all else fails, go for the fingers. Oh, that looks way better. Now you guys know my secrets. Finger painting. Nice. That's a cool color now. Finger painting. Get a little more purple in there. Oh, I love that color now. Can you see that? Kind of cool. Very planety looking. Happy with it. Hey, Jacqueline. Welcome. Sweet. Thanks, Carmen. You buy me the canvas, girlfriend. We can get one for Miss Twinkle. Gee, where could we get a canvas? Hmm. These silver rocket ships are cute. All right, bring it on. I see another Periscope video in my future. Twinkle, twinkle, little star. That's Carmen's grandbaby, Twinkle. I don't even remember her real name. It starts with a V. Vera Miles, that's what it is. Vera, like Vera Miles, I think. Carmen doesn't like that name because she thinks it sounds like an old lady's name. She just got a room and they bought a house? That's awesome. Thank God she has a bedroom. We don't want her going without a room. And I bet her room is modern and cute like Pinteresty. Because that's what all the young, cool, hip kids are doing. Oh, I heard my laundry buzzing. That means I have work to do. Laundry's done. Oh, God, that silver is really cool. I'm going to do a second coat over here. See what happens when we put two coats on. Yep. Definitely needs two coats. All right, ladies, I know you're getting bored watching me paint, so we'll wrap this up soon and I'll finish it and then you can see it on on Facebook or something. No? All right, I'll keep going. All right. Whatever. Let's get a little gray in here because she wanted gray. Not bored. All right, I believe you. How about this plate of color? Give me some hearts if you like this plate of color. <laughs> you guys are so easy to please. Uh, so funny. All right. I'll keep going then. I mean, I'm going to do it with or without you here. So if you want to keep watching, I got no problem with that. So let's come back around. We'll let that dry. Sorry, it's going to be upside down for a few minutes because I need to do this rocket ship right side up. And we're going to do it kind of purpley gray because Oh, I like that gray. Do you guys, if you use um, acrylics do you use them straight out of the bottle, or do you always mix a little bit into it? I never use them straight out of the bottle, except that Robin's A green, which has got to go. Because Joanne was right. It's drying and looking green. So I'll have to put blue over it or something. But, anyway.
Okay, I didn't see an answer from anybody, so I'm going to assume you use them straight out of the bottle. Carmen, if you're still there, have you heard anything from Paula? This is a two-tone rocket ship. I'm going to try to watch. No, I mix them. Yeah, I mix them too. It's more fun that way you get your own colors. Do you mix with other colors? Yes, of course. So like this gray is gray or black and white to make gray and then I added some purple into it to make weird funky gray. That makes it all more fun. And we're going to add more black into it. So we're going to get a really dark gray for the rocket launcher part. And blue in there, I don't know. Some weird colors going on. I don't know what I like better, the gray or the silver. They're both pretty cool. I never thought about doing colored pencil as an outline until I did all the outlining on this with colored pencil. And man, that was super fun. Color pencil on canvas. What a concept. Came out really cool. Let's do this star. I can't wait to do the moon. You make it look so easy. <laughs> Piece of cake. I just started this painting stuff yesterday. Haven't been doing it at all. That's a lie. I had my store for 30 years and we painted on kids boxes and clipboards and picture frames every day for 30 years. So, kind of been doing this a long time, the paper rabbit way. They're still doing it. So if you need anything personalized with your kid's name and um, on little plastic boxes and clipboards and picture frames, go to the paper rabbit. I think it's the paperrabbitmontrose.com. They're still doing it. Show them some love and buy some gifts. It's just not me doing it. It's them doing it. I sold it. Oh, really nice girl. Okay. I watercolored on canvas and added colored pencil with chalks. Who said that? Is that Joanne? I'm so proud, whoever that was. So proud. I'm even more proud if that was Joanne because she is a rubber stamper, and I'm so surprised. She made me the cutest bunny pillow. That one day I opened the mail and there was this bunny pillow. A little gift for me. And man, was it nice. May not be as cute as yours. Oh, it was Brave Mom that said that. Claudia. Claudia number two. Because I have to keep my friend Claudia number one. I'm sorry. Claudia one and Claudia two. All right. So let's get... Uh, here, this is kind of... Oh, that's too blue. Well... Let's add this, this purple, and see what happens here. Add some blue to it. Ooh, that's a cool color. That took that blue and changed it into something super cool. Kind of a bluey green, very boyish. I'm going to try to take my paint pens when I'm done and go back in the window and add some uh, little Martians. Pretty excited about that. Could you tell? It's the little things, really. All right, gotta get rid of this greenish peacocky color. Awful. You. I love my ideas too. My head is full of them. Would you like to live in here for a while? Because it makes you insane. I had to leave work today because I had so many ideas I couldn't stay there. Well, 
there were also crazy people that I work with that I could not work with. Well, I should keep my mouth shut. I don't want to get fired. But anyway, I'm just a crazy artist, and I guess I went a little crazy today. We'll leave it at that. I had to get out of there. I had to. Okay, so here's a really cool tip. Let's see if I can do it. Um, you take your brush. So you take your brush. I Yeah, maybe it's a full moon. Carmen, is it a full moon coming? All right, so you take your brush and pounce it, and you can make dots with the back side of your brush. I'm not getting enough color, though, so let's use this. There we go. See how the dots come out from the tail end of your brush? I don't know where I learned that. Maybe Bob Ross. That's so cute. Can't ever have enough dots. Off camera. What did I miss? Something happened off camera. Oops. Oh dear. I set my plate down on top of the canvas. Wee -oo, wee -oo, wee -oo. Oh, dots are off camera. The nerve of people calling. Oh. It's because they're underneath where everybody's comments are. I'm sorry. Well, you'll see them when they're done. Do you guys see this now? Here, I'll put some dots by the stars. You can put dots wherever you want. Isn't that cool? So, now we'll turn it this way. You guys see this big blue dot right here? I made a boo-boo. Lindsay made boo-boos. Uh, that's why we put dots down. Dots are your friend. They cover up every mistake. And they look like stars on this one, so it's cute. Man, she is getting her money's worth today, this girl. She's going to love it. And I'll have to make more baby signs because all her friends are going to want one. Thank you. I like it too. I think it's coming out pretty cute. Let's do a little point here. Use purple for the top of the spaceship. Oh, another Lindsay Biffo. Oh well. I'll fix that with colored pencils or paint pens. That is way bigger than I wanted that polka dot. That's okay. There we go. That worked. Okay. Lavender stripes gone in here. It's time to clean the brush. Oh, that may still be wet, but that's okay. Oh, the wind is howling. Biffed again. Let that one dry. Add in the jet fuel. I don't like this orange and yellow. It's just awfully thin. Yeah, 
that has to get fixed. Something, somehow, who knows what. Let's try to fix this. Allergies today. Everything is sniffling. Oh, that one dried nicely. Give that a second coat. Can't wait to put a face on the moon. Most people want to put a man on the moon. Not me. I want to put a face. Might need one more star, I'm not sure. This yellow is weird and thin. It'll definitely need some colored pencil in it. I think I need another star over here. Push everything out of the way. Don't ask me how to draw stars. You just have to practice them. They take a lot of years to draw like that. Trust me. Okay. A few more polka dots. You guys all still there? Still breathing? Everything going good? All right, I gotta put my rings on the planet. And then we're gonna turn this puppy off. And I'm gonna go grab some colored pencils. Yes, mesmerizing, really? Can you guys come here every day? Ooh, it started raining. I'm getting my wellies on and gotta go for a splash. Oh, night night, Carmelita. It's been raining here all day. All right, let's see if we can do this in one. Nope. Nope. Ran out of paint. planet this is. It's the blue planet. Okay. Oops. Okay. Get our rocket thrusters here. I should have done these earlier. a lot of detail. It's kind of boring to me. Oh, I like this rocket ship. We Californians are excited that we've had some rain lately, so you'll have to forgive us. Forgive Carmen for leaving and going outside to get some rain. I know Claudia the other Claudia, Claudia number one, understands. She's in Washington. They get too much rain sometimes. All right. Might be all we do. Let's see. I just got here. What about? Just, oh, it just got here. That's funny, I talked to my mom. She didn't say it was raining there, but she's a little further away from you, Joanne. Try to fix this fiasco over here. What happened to that? Got 
got some weird paint going on. Gotta go buy more Target paint. I think it's thicker than what I'm trying to use here. Oh, there we go. Fixed it. Alright. Oh, who's listening to the rain? We took our walk already. It was pouring. It was awesome. Alright, so let's look at this. Okay. So there is the whole thing. Let's look at it up close and personal. I'm gonna miss the light because I'm standing in it now. So there's a rocket ship coming down from the heavens. There's his name. Oh, I just love that moon so much. Anyway, then here's this rocket ship. That one's gonna get the Martian in it. This one up here might get a Martian too, I'm not sure. And this one is that old fashioned rocket. So, okay, we're gonna let this dry and you guys will have to check my Instagram or the blog. I know, I don't know what to do with this name yet, but it's pretty boring, isn't it? It's like, ugh, boring. I'll do something. Um, okay, so thanks again for watching. And yeah, so I'll put this on Instagram. It'll probably be on my blog. And uh, whoever asks me if I will upload these to YouTube, I'm going to give it my best shot. Okay? So, peace out. Till next time. See you in outer space.